Hello, everyone. My name is Timito Kweshogbamu. I'm the founder of the Evidence Used in Environmental Policy Making in Nigeria project, affiliated with the University of Lagos. I'm an environmental toxicologist and pollution management specialist by training. I was privileged to be um, one of the awardees, or should I say the winner of the African Evidence Leadership Award, Evidence Intermediate Risk Category in 2022. And um, this was actually a testament of the achievements of the Helping Project since it was conceived in 2020. And the Helping Project basically facilitates interactions between evidence producers and evidence users, as well as brokers within the environmental space in Nigeria, but now also as well across Africa and the world. Since 2022, we have gone ahead to implement quite a number of initiatives and partnerships, as well as collaborations with policymakers and researchers within Nigeria and across Africa. Um, specifically, we are currently collaborating on a trans African project, a partnership project called Clean Air um, Africa that is funded by the US Department of State. Um, it's actually the PI is actually ECHO, and we are supporting the Air Quality Management Research Group at the University of Lagos that is leading that partnership for Africa and for Nigeria and West Africa and the Helping Project in collaboration with the Environmental Evidence Synthesis and Knowledge Translation Research Group, um, which is institutionalized through the European project, is facilitating the policy output of that project across Africa. Um, we had the opportunity to co-host um, the Clean Air Forum, which occurred last week between July 8th and 12th in Lagos, and it was the second edition of the Clean Air Forum in Africa. And um, we've also been celebrating EIDM champions who are basically trained participants from our European trainings from 2020 and 2021 specifically. Our communities of practice continue to emerge, continue to form networks and partnerships across the world and Nigeria, but especially between evidence users, evidence producers, and evidence brokers. We are very excited and um, happy about the stride that the European project has taken from the seed funding we received from APIDEB in 2020 and further support in 2021. Um, I must say that we are also part of the Africa LIPS project where we are supporting the um, Nigeria team from um, Professor Jesse Unekev to be precise, current um, VC of the David Umayi University of Health Sciences, supporting um, learning for um, environmental evidence use and um, partnerships here in Nigeria. Thank you so much, Afideb, once again to the African Evidence Network and to all our trained participants and prospective participants um, who involve in our trainings and capacity development programs, including our secondment initiatives. We hope that we we'll continue to expand the base of environmental evidence use, not only in Nigeria, but indeed across Africa and the world. Thank you very much for your time.